Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to learn about design and simulation of function generator. Okay. So if I say function generator, that means we will understand the design and simulation of square wave. We will understand the design and simulation of triangular wave and we will understand the design and simulation of sine wave right s i n e right design and simulation of sine wave so we will understand how this circuit works how will you how will you design the circuits for function the generator and at the end i'll run the simulation and i'll show you how by using these box by using these circuits how you can easily generate square wave, triangular wave and sine wave. So this is very interesting video guys. After watching this video, you will be able to design and simulate the circuit of function generator. Okay. So this function generator is most commonly used instrument in the electronics laboratory. Okay. So if you if you want to test something, this is most frequently used instrument. Whether you want to generate square wave, whether you want to generate triangular wave, whether you want to generate sinusoidal wave, whether you want to generate the pulse wave, whatever you want to generate at given frequency and amplitude, you can generate by using function generator, right? So this, this is going to be very in completely interested, interesting video today. Okay. If you want this video till end, you will be able to design your own function generator. Okay. At least you will know how you can gen design the function generator. And uh, if you are using function generator in your electronics board testing, you can visualize how those signals are generated and what are the internal circuitry of function generator right so without any delay let us understand this circuit first okay so you can see this is my first block okay this is my first block in the first block i use the op amp lt1498 and i connected it via dual supply if I say dual supply, that means it has positive voltage and it has negative voltage. If you look at what is the value of V plus and if you look at what is the value of V minus, you can find here the V plus is 12 volt and the V minus here is minus 12 volt. So this op amp U1 LT1498 is powered up with dual supply that is one positive supply and one negative supply and you can see here this is some kind of multi vibrator circuit okay so this is some kind of multi vibrator circuit you can use i used one capacitor these two resistances here okay so this since this is multi vibrator circuit this generates square wave output so I'll show you what is the output of this first block. This is the square wave, right? Square wave generator, this circuit. Then this is the second block. And you can see here the second block. In the second block, what is that? In the second block, you can see your input is here at the negative terminal of U2 is a square wave. Okay. So then I used one capacitor. That means I am, this circuit is an integrator. So that means I am integrating a square wave into a triangular wave. That is how this circuit generates triangular wave. I'll, I'll show you the output of this block. Then these two blocks is to generate, okay. This two block is to generate the the sinusoidal wave. So after this stage U4, you will see here the sine wave. Okay. So this is 
you can see here you will get here triangular wave and i am trying to integrate again this is again integrator okay integrator so i am again trying to integrate the triangular wave into sine wave okay okay and this is for 180 degree phase shift okay this is for 180 degree phase shift so let me repeat this guys again once again let me explain to you okay so this op amp is powered up with dual supply plus 12 volt and minus 12 volt u1 u2 u3 and u4 this is the multi vibrator stage which generate square wave this is integrator stage which generate triangular wave this is again integrator state which generate triangular a sinusoidal wave since it is integrating to a triangular wave and this is again this is again inverting amplifier which inverts the the 180 signal of this stage to 180 out of phase so this this at this point you will get sine wave at this point you will get triangular wave and at this point you will get you will get square wave so let me run the transient analysis to run the transient analysis you go at simulate edit simulation command and stop time is 500 right so let me click on ok and let me run the simulation okay so let me show you one by one so let me add three plot pane okay so in the first plot pane i'll show you the square wave in the second plot pane i'll show you the triangular wave and in the third plot pane i'll show you the sinusoidal signal so you can see all three signals together this is square wave this is v triangle triangular wave and this is b sine that is sinusoidal wave let me further zoom here at some this point of time at steady state guys can you see this is the square wave this is the triangular wave this is the sinusoidal wave and let me show you the frequency for square wave <coughs> let me attach the cursor and you can see the frequency for the frequency for this square wave is how much 1.6 kilohertz guys okay the frequency for the square wave is 1.6 kilohertz so guys by using a very simple circuit and dual dc power supply plus 12 volt and minus 12 volt you can design your own function generator so guys that is how you will generate you will generate a square wave a triangular wave a sine wave you know a sine wave and you can use this very simple circuit okay you can use this very simple circuit i will upload this file into a google drive you can get the access of this file you can play around the component and maybe you can try to have a bit better output shape like better sine wave better triangular wave and better square wave you can also play around the frequency of this signal okay so hope guys you have understood how will you design and simulate a function generator in lt spice if you have any further question feel free to ask me in comment section thanks for watching this video